Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am Jake Smash. This is another Watcher of Realms video. It is 2048, Tuesday, January the 16th. We are still doing an account takeover, a massive one. Uh, I'm on my friend Livewire's account. We've done gear raid 119, 219, 319, artifact material raids 16 and 17. Couldn't quite get 18. Uh, we need better gear. We absolutely need better gear. We're, we're working with like a lot of yellow gear. Uh, but now we're going to work on Guild Boss. So I haven't looked at this yet. I'm excited. Guild Boss, he is doing nothing, nothing. 6,500. Okay, so he's attacking twice. On Nightmare 3. Why? Half of 17 is 8.5. So you cross the 6500 threshold. Why did you put a second key into this instead of doing Nightmare 2? I don't know. Regardless, we're going to work on it. So let's see what, what team we're working with. Ooh. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Twin Fiend, Dolores, Zilla 2, Hex, Nocturne, Wrath, Abomination. I think what we're going to do, let's, I saw, because I already did gear raids. Let's get you out of here. Let's get you out of here. Check this out. Ara Aracha. Silas. Disgusting. I love it. Volca. We're going to have Laurel. And we have a Hollow. So if we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Yep. There's seven on the board at any one time. Well, seven on the board permanently, and then we'll rotate through the other three. Yeah. All right, let's do it. We're gonna put our best gear on Zilla 2. Here. Oh, I think we already put our best gear on her. Yeah, for uh, AMR, we needed our best gear on her. Okay, so we got her crit capped. Uh, next best gear will go to Silas. We have a Salazar, but I think Silas is going to do more with Racha. So let's go to Silas. A1 Silas, let's swap your gear. Let's take... Salazar's gear, it's curse. That'll get you up to 10k. About Cerberus. 10k, 25. That's what I thought. We don't have much to work with here, ladies and gentlemen, but that is okay. We got the big milestones out of the way. Gear raid 19. Now you can start farming some good gear. It's a decent Volca set. I will use that. Now this is the best I'm going to get for Silas. So I've, I've already basically built out the best DPS sets for the account. Let's use Hex next. A2 Hex. I don't have an A2 Hex. Volca. There we go. Next is going to be Nocturne. Swap. So we've got Zilla 2, Hex, Silas. Let's see who, what we've got. There we go. So those are our four big DPS. And then I can't put like Apollo, Dolores, Volca. I can't put them in Invigoration. Um, so I'll probably just auto equip. I don't need anything on Laurel. I'm just despawning them. Um, Volca and Aracha. Let's. Give some 
just something to put on them so they don't die right away. Hollow. What is hollow wearing? Okay, that's fine. Hmm, 20. 20 here. Same thing. You're not going to be doing much damage here, buddy. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so on Nightmare 3, I feel like, so if he's doing 8k, I can get, I can get 20k with this team. I'm fairly certain. Fairly. So for anyone that hasn't seen this before, uh, lots of rage, right? The timing of champs doesn't really matter because there's no invigoration anywhere. We're not trying to time that. I'm going to put Zilla 2 in the back so that she can get, um, instead of right up front by the boss, right? So she has a passive where she gets um, additional damage if she's blocking someone. However, uh, when, uh, when we're doing this, I want her to have, um, to get the extra rage from Laurel. So that's why I put her in the back because her being able to do her ult over and over again, I'm actually, depending on what this run does, I might cancel the whole thing and put hex on... A Racha's bonus instead of Twin Fiend. Because Twin Fiend isn't doing much with his nukes, right? That's the big point of him being with Twin Fiend. Because um, he'll get the same stat bonuses with either of them. But on a Racha, he won't lose uptime by when Twin Fiend does his ult. Here we go. So he was doing 8k. He must be getting the second shield down, but not the third. So let's see. Done with Volca. We get Laurel back down. We'll wait. We'll use Nocturnes. That way we don't waste the 50%. That's right there. There we go. Use everyone's ults. Baracha doing some damage some damage. Not much, but she's there. She's helping. So we're at almost 4k. As long as we can get the shield. Just slowly tick away. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe we can't do 20k. But if we can get above 12, or 10, excuse me, then we can 2 key it. That'll be something. Come on, Hollow. Keep everyone alive. You can do it. All right. Get that shield down, everyone. Get Aracha out of there. Get Laurel down. Pop Silas's ult. Get Laurel back out. Volca down. We're at 6k. Hmm. I'm not doing nearly as much as I thought I would be doing. Let's. Use the folks that are above 90. Use everyone. I'm going to get this shield down. Yeah. Okay. 
so we're over 10. So that'll let him two key it. Not nearly as good as I was hoping for. Yeah. Well, that's a healthy two key. Is that? And then, so if we can get, wait a minute. What? What's the chest in between sixty-five? There isn't one. That's the third chest. So it becomes a two key if he wants to do gems. Okay, let's do it. 13. Yeah, we'll leave that. And we can do a Nightmare 4 run and get him the bottom chest. Yeah. Okay, so we got 13. I'm going to take a picture of that for him. There we go. And then, so, if I can get him, man, I don't know. Oh, he already bought the extra stone today, so I can't. OK, well, uh, maybe I'll be back for a Nightmare 4 takeover. We'll see. Um, man, I thought I could, thought I could get one there. But uh, thank you so much for your time. If you appreciated that, um, support the channel. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends. I will see you in the next one.